Welcome, Bunkerland investors, to the future of the Doomsday Bunker. I'm Bunky the Bunker, the Bunkerland mascot bunker. Let's go to Bunkerland. <laughs> Bunkerland will be a multi-level Doomsday experience like none other you've seen. After all, why shouldn't the rich, uh, I meant, <laughs> why shouldn't we enjoy the end of the world as we know it? Right, Anthony Rogers. A am I right, Anthony Rogers? I agree wholeheartedly. Hi, I'm Anthony Rogers, founder of Bunkerland. And thanks to your generous donations, we can finally make Bunkerland a reality. Suboptimal reaction to the intro video, as expected. Hey, what's our catchphrase, Bunky? When shit hits the fan, go, go to, to Bunkerland. Bunkerland. Ah! Hey, folks, glad you can make it. Before we get started, everyone know each other? You got Ned from iodinetablets.net. iodinetablets.net. Hello. Linda from Clean Water Source No Questions Clean Asked. Clean Water Source No Questions Asked. And Eddie from Miners Without Morals. Miners Without Morals. You like that intro video? <laughs> I'm sorry about how weird that got. We all, uh, we all got pretty high towards the end of that day. How about a tour? Um, I'm sorry, but you'll all have to sign these liability forms first. Phew, quick thinking, Dale. Well, I just thought we'd avoid another rebar incident. Uh, what incident? On, on the alcoholics arts and crafts level? Remember that whole thing? Yeah, I know. Just, just shut your mouth about it, okay? Okay, paperwork done. Come on, let's go see our cash cow. Aside from the basic housing levels, every single level in Bunkerland will have its own special theme, each with theme-related activities to distract from the apocalypse above. We'll all be in a cage soon. See? We're all in a cage now. Wait, I've got to clean this cage. Well, how do you expect to distract people from the apocalypse? Ah, well, uh, tell them, Dale. Well, we designed Bunkerland to be completely immersive. Yeah, some folks might even forget they're in a bunker. Each level will feel like its own world, except for, you know, no, no laws and very slim security, which could actually prove to be a problem depending on how long- Oh look, it's the casino level. Ah, the casino level. Here, residents can lose all their money to us. Speaking of losing money, our multi-level pass holders will have access to the elevator and easy access to all the levels during their extended stay. Access to all the levels? Seems like a good deal. Oh, oh don't worry, it won't be. There'll be plenty of opportunities for in-level purchasing. <laughs> um, sir? What is it, Dale? Well, oh, uh, I'm afraid there's some urgent things you need to attend to in the control room. Not now. Oh, hey, look. Check this out. It's some important stuff. The water comes straight from the nearby lake. Clean as you can get it. Here, Dale, take a sip. Uh, sir, sir, I don't want just to... Have a, just drink it. Come on, Dale. Okay. No, I was... <laughs> I was kidding. That stuff will kill you. But you could drink it. I mean, it's that clean. It's so clean. Sir, I must insist you look at some of these reports. They're shocking. They're truly shocking. Okay, everyone, follow me. For instance, reports indicate that our drinking water supply could become contaminated from the surface. Okay, then we got Karen here from... It's Linda. Linda from Clean Water Source. No questions asked? Because I have zero question. Our second backup water supply will be clean. That's why it's called that, right? Not to mention- Dale, shut the- Looks to me like someone high up signed off on cutting some corners. How about that elevator music? Ho ho ho! I love it! Dale, stay here. I hope nothing bad happens in the long run. I guess we'll see. And that's only the surface of what Bunkerland has to offer. Thanks to your generous financial contributions. So, who's ready to go to Bunkerland? Heh <laughs> Let's go get some lunch. Yeah, Fuck food. yeah. Free food. Oh, I love lunch. Well, I love free food. Well, now while we need some shit to go down, we can get our money back. <laughs> One can only hope. <laughs> <laughs>
Emma's got him. Die, you fiends. Your reign of demonic tyranny has come to an end. Now yield. Yeah, die already. Demons, evil creatures, you. Oh, beware, Cory. The boss approaches. Shit, oh, damn. Sean, grab the arrows of Anarchian. No, no, you got it, Cory. Shoot him in the eye. In the eye, Cory. Oh. oh, you foul thing. Well, that's to be expected when you cross a level 20 boss as a level 13 centaurian archer and a level 12 ice warlock. Yeah, it's not our fault. The demon boss is totally OP in the video game. Yeah, he's not like that in the books. Yeah, or the movie. Should we, uh... I'll get the popcorn! Yes! Hey, I'm gonna go get some freshly recycled air. Day 25,000... 54... Fuck it. Fuck this. You know, frozen grapes are a great snack. It's just something I've been eating recently. Wow, I think I'm gonna have to give that one a try. Nothing but net. Oh, my other eye! Mmm, that's good stuff. Nice day, isn't it? What? I said, uh, nice day. Good day, right? Here? Yeah. Well, yeah, I suppose. Well, have a good rest of your morning. Well, I guess afternoon now. Wow, already. Time flies when you're having fun. The filters seem to be working. I don't know, the, the weather seems nice today. More clean. The, the air seems more clear today, doesn't it? Oh, well, y you know, living inside, not much changes. I, I don't notice a huge difference. Right. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna go eat lunch. Oh, well, have a good meal. You too. What? I, I already had lunch. I already ate lunch. That's fine. Bye now. Oh, he's weird. <laughs> oh, I love this movie. You ready? Wait, wait. Okay, play. What the hell? What's going on? There's more chaos in the streets than when the vending machine jammed. Ah! Oh, reach detected. Oh, we're so dead. Uh, okay, I got a plan. Grab all the toilet paper and canned food you can grab. We gotta hide in the bathtub. There's someone else out there. We have an intruder. Sean? Fight with me, Cory, for basic housing level 12. Sean, what are you doing? Help me defend against the invaders. This is not a movie, Sean. Get your ass back inside. To battle. Oh, whoa. Look at that. What's going on? Where, where are you all going? Wait, where are you all going? Huh. <laughs> Wait, wait for me! Why, it's trading posts and artifacts. You wanna check it out? Uh, nah, I'm good. This, uh, this kind of stuff isn't really my thing. Artifacts and cool stuff and such, I'm not a fan. <laughs> oh! Whoa! 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 That's, wow, look at that. Whoa! Anti-radiation armor. Oh, cool. Hey, Jim, maybe you could ask for it half off. Says a talking coyote. Maybe you should ask for it full off. 100% off. Maybe I will. You should. I'm, I'm going to. Great, tell me how it goes. I will tell you how it goes. Do you, do you want me to come to your place and tell you, or do you want to come to mine? Uh, I, I don't. Whatever works. Um, we'll play it by ear. Okay, uh, ha have a good day. Talk to you later. Corey, come look at this. The Sword of Vindicar. Previously owned by King Snake Spider during the Siege of Wastelandia. And stolen ten days ago by me. <laughs> oh, and my buddy Griggs. Uh, yeah, we all know Griggs. Careful now, that model of knife launcher's got a faulty trigger. Manufacturing error or something. And it comes in green. Oh, cut! Whoops. Hey, it's all good. Luckily, we've got another one. Bring out Gary number six. <clears throat> and it comes in green. Okay, how much for it? Those are some nice cargo pants you got on there. Done. If we bought this, we'd have two swords, and we could do battle, battle recreations. recreations. Yes. So you guys gonna buy that thing or what? Oh, it's so cool. Let's yeah, buy yeah, it. Yeah, let's buy it. How much for it? Uh, three grand. Whoa. <laughs> but you just sold that knife launcher for some pants. And that's a good deal if you knew the trouble it's brought me. Whew. Crazy shit, I tell you. Didn't you say you stole this? Yeah, I stole it. And I nearly died trying. Cool. Wait, which level did you steal it from? Some sort of crazy monster fantasy level? What the hell are you talking about? I ain't some bunk junkie weirdo like you two. Wait, are you from the surface? 
That's right. What? No way. It's a wasteland up there. It's not survivable. How do you know? You ever been? Uh, no, actually. Why not? It's actually quite nice if you can get past all the things that want to kill you. Oh, kind of like Australia. I saw an Australia theme level in the Bunkerland brochure. Because it's Australia. You been there? Sadly, no. Have you been anywhere? Well, no. Why the hell not? But we don't have a multi-level pass, that's why. What the hell is that? Mm, you know, li like the sign says? Under the signs, multi-level. Notice, use of elevators limited to multi-level pass holders, which can be purchased for an additional fee. Now that's some bullshit. There you go. You're welcome. You guys are damn sheep, aren't you? You gotta be goats if you want to get anywhere in life. Here, guys, I'm gonna show you something. Wait, where are you going? We are going to the surface. Uh, the surface of what? Cool! Oh, the surface! L let's think about this for a second. Nope. You gotta see what the real world looks like. None of this multi-level pass sky panel bullshit. But there are... snake spiders, like you said. There are worse things than snake spiders in Wastelandia. You can be damn sure of that. Come on, Cory, it'll be fun! Like that one time we did that one thing. But Sean... Uh you're always talking about wanting to start an adventure, Cory. I meant like restarting an open world video game, Sean. All right, I'm pressing this damn button in two seconds. Two? Wait, 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 wait. that's so random. Two, what? Oh, okay, fine, one. fine. I read fine. You might need these. But I don't need extra pants. That's what they always say. This should be a quick trip. I got some stuff to sell. Okay, I can't believe we're actually going to the surface. There you go, Cory, getting into it. Whoa, Cory, you gotta try this. Hold on now, I, I don't know how much more this thing can take. Come on, Wyatt, just try it. Oh, all right. <laughs> oh! 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 I've got this. Oh! Well, that didn't exactly go as planned. But things can only go up from here. Up, up, up from here, because we're stuck at the bottom of the fucking bunker. But that doesn't mean we still can't have a bit of adventure. Oh, yeah, I think... Things are gonna go great for us now. I hope I didn't just jinx it. Oh, why'd you have to say that, Cory? By saying that, you've already jinxed it. I was being metaphorical. I don't really believe in jinxes. I'm not one of those people. Jinxes do exist. See, if you say that, it reverses the jinx's effect. <laughs> oh shit, by saying that, I've then re-reversed it. Uh, jinxes exist. There. What the? Alright, hop on out now. And hell, I thought Bunkerland was gonna be boring. Well, here's to adventure. Oh, oh, shit! Oh, there it is. We're officially totally screwed. Oh, Wyatt! Our most trusted guide has fallen in battle! What battle? What are you talking about, Sean? Wyatt, you will be forever remembered! Oh, look at this place, Cory! Whoa. I feel like we're in the Shadow Realm of Detrethia. Wow. The Shadow Realm of Detrethia. Mm-hmm. Yep. More like the gateway to the fire world of it. Wait, hey, what's that? Oh, it's giant spiders! No, no, they're slithering. They're snakes! Birds? No. They're flying snake spiders. These slithering bastards must have tunneled down from the surface. Whoa, whoa, Wyatt, how'd you survive all that? I cannot be killed by rock nor flame. How, though? It's called survival tactics, like this one. You're gonna want to get behind me. But fucking survival tactics teach resurrection and fire retardancy. Is that the stolen sword of Vindicar? That must be the thief who has robbed our most beloved king, Snake Spider. We must apprehend him. Now, attack! Retrieve the sword at all costs! I got this! You have taken my legs, but luckily, I have the ability to slither as well. I can't get close enough to the sword! Plan B! Plan B! Ha! Ah! Ah! Our tunnels are loot! Damn, who are these guys? Fire scorpions. They've been encroaching upon our territories for years. Pick up the sword, you fool. I have no legs. This is gonna sting. Is that a fucking scorpion pod? Oh, it's so weird being outside her level. 
I feel like we're finally the protagonists. No, I feel more like we're the dumb, stupid side characters that get lost in the sewers and end up being found dead by the real protagonists. And there's the start of the movie, following these new, better characters. No way! But side characters have lasted this long? Sean, we've been down here for like five minutes. And within those five minutes, we've almost found our demise two, three times already. But wasn't it fun? I'm not gonna say it was fun. It was hella cinematic, if anything. Oh, you know it was! You, do you smell fire? I smell burnt hair. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. I'm going in. Wait, Sean, no. That's not what I meant. I want to see the thing I've been whittling. <sighs> yeah, I guess. Hand it over. Hey. Sean. Hey, how's it going? Cool tent. Sean, uh. Hey, everybody. Hey. hey. Oh, I like your shorts. God damn it, Sean. You can't just talk to random people. For all we know, they could be cannibals or something crazy. I highly doubt that, Corey. Hey. Fresh meat. Not yet, Ted, you idiot. Welcome, weary travelers. Join our fire. Many thanks, friend. Well, uh, we should probably keep going. We got things to do. No, we don't. What are you talking about, Corey? He's always saying crazy stuff like that. I know, I was, I was just... Do you want some Gary soup? If you don't mind me asking, what brings you here? The lure of adventure! And a crazy old man. That's the title of my autobiography. Oh, that's cool. Mine would be titled, Let's Get Out of Here, Sean. That's a weird title, Corey. Mine would be titled, The Adventures of Sean. Speaking of adventures, what brought you all down here? Richard. We were outcast in our home level. Here is the only place in Bunkerland where we can truly be ourselves. Oh, cool. What are the other levels like? Oh, do the other levels have buffets with ice cream machines and waffle makers and, and pancake machines? You know, the ones that look like the little conveyor belts that spit out little tiny pancakes? Once, perhaps. Meaning? Meaning Bunkerland has gone to shit. Listen, things get pretty wild when people are stuck inside the apocalyptic equivalent of a theme park for several generations. Things... things happen to a person. Well, if things are so crazy, why don't people just leave? I mean, the surface is survivable, so I've heard. No one leaves their level anymore but us. We're trailblazers. We're revolutionary. Wait, wait, I thought you said you were outcast from your level. Let's just say the yoga retreat level wasn't overly fond of nudists. Yeah, neither was the family-friendly finger painting level. Okay, I see what you're saying. I pour the milk before the cereal. I only wear socks if they're wet. I play the accordion. Okay, enough. Get away from me. We escape the constructs of society above to live here as free beings. <laughs> Speak for yourself, Richard. Oh, don't mind Chuck. He's just a little upset because he lost the drawing. Well, I'm genuinely apprehensive about asking, but what is the drawing? Well, we quickly realize that there's no food down here. So we draw sticks every week to see who, you know, will be eaten next. And Chuck lost this week's drawing, fair and square. I didn't lose the drawing, it was fixed. Everybody knows it. Ted gave me the short stick. He just wants to eat me because I'm a chicken. It's just the look of the draw, pal. Easy for you to say, Richard. No one wants to eat you, you dirty rat bastard. Look at you. You're, you're a dirty rat bastard. And then look at me. I'm a chicken. I'm more tasty than all of you. This is not even a joke. I'm, a, I'm delicious. That's weird. Hold on, did, did you say Gary's soup or Gary's soup? What's the difference? Here are the intruders, my lord! Finally! Now we can take over the underground! Wait, hold up. Uh, isn't that the uh, Snake Spider National Anthem? <laughs> Snake Spiders, attack! Deal. Let's get him. I had too much caffeine, and now all that I've seen is snake spiders. Yeah. Oh, they can climb and can fly, and they slither on by their snake spiders. Yeah. There was no one around to confirm hmm. what I found. The this soup tastes spiders. really weird. Oh, you actually yeah. ate that? We're supposed to eat the soup, yeah. Sean. The snake spiders, yeah. 
Well, now that you're part of the group, you might as well participate in our weekly stick drawing. Corey? Actually, I think we uh, might be heading, uh, g going now. Um, you don't happen to know another way out of here besides the elevator, do you? Oh, oh, I do. I know where the stairs are. I can show them to you. You just gotta um, get me out of this little cage here. Oh, no, you drew the short stick, Chuck. It's only fair that you stay around to be eaten. Eat shit, Bob. You know what? Chicken wings sound real good right now. You know what else sounds really good right now? Drop kicking your ass into the fire. Run! Run, damn! Run, damn it, run! The hordes of hell are here! Stand your ground! Stand your ground! What do we do? We can take them! Get your fighting stance, Corey! Stop it, Sean! Don't draw their attention! Put your arms up! It looks cool! Run, you moron! What are you doing standing there for? Hey, hey, help me! Help! Guys, where are you going? Oh, yeah, sorry. Thanks for the help. If only I could return the favor. But you can return the favor. Where are the stairs? Stairs? What are, what are you talking about? Oh, stairs. Um, oh. I'm not gonna go over there, because it's a shit show. Um, how about that way? This is the way? This is the way. Come on. Oh. <laughs> this is gonna sting! Oh, shit. Wait, is that the modeled KT-124 knife launcher? You know your stuff! Ha! <laughs> <laughs> you should've got yourself a warranty, you dumbass. Learn your knife launchers. The stairs, Chuck! Where are the stairs? Okay, yeah, um, so here's the deal. I don't actually know where the stairs are. What? what? But I have an elevator pass that I stole from my cousin. I specifically asked for a way out of here besides the elevator. Did, didn't I? Yes, I, I believe you did. I believe I did. I, well, I have not seen any stairs, but we can find them. Guys, <laughs> when have we ever failed a mission? That's right, never. We've never failed a mission because we've never been on a mission together. You just gotta trust us, guys. Trust in the process. It's not that hard. I, I think you're smarter than you let on. I think you guys really doubt yourself sometimes. I don't know where I'm going with this. Chuck, use your powers of flight to scout out a path to safety. Oh, right, yeah. I haven't done much flighting. <laughs> flighting? That's not a word. Um, fuck's sake, get going. I haven't done much flying lately, but I'll, I'll try. They're coming. Yeah, yeah, I'm getting on. I'm getting on. <laughs> Would you look at that? Wow, I'm good. Oh, whoa, oh, come help. on, someone. Yo, wide, wide. Oh. Give us some help. <sighs> Damn it. Hey, the sword is ours. Truce over. Rah! Septimus, we are legion. Well, thanks for waiting for me. I swear this place is more fucked up than a literal apocalyptic wasteland. Well, it's been fun, but I think this is it for y'all. Yeah, this doesn't look good. We, y'all. Hold on. Beware, Sean. The boss approaches. <gasps> Just like the Demons of the Lost Realm game. Oh, what? We played this game called Demons of the Lost Realm, and it's so cool. Demons of the Lost Realm? That sounds dope as hell. Hey guys, be quiet. I'm trying to aim here. It takes, like, lots of, it takes, lots, it takes lots of focus. In the eye, Corey. You got this. I got this. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, oh, fuck! Damn! Oh, nice shot, Corey. Uh, here, let me try. Oh! Haha, <laughs> there you go, Ted. You gave me the short stick, so now you'll need a short stick to walk as a crutch. Here, let me find another one. No, 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 stairs first. Where are the stairs, Chuck? <laughs> yeah, sorry. You distracted me, Corey. But Wyatt, the sword! Hey, don't worry. I always have a spare relic for these specific situations. We're chilling. How'd you... <laughs> a fake! Even more short-lived, yet just as crucial, that ensures the return of the Sword of Indicar once again! Deal! Rah! Chuck! Yeah, follow me, follow me. Oh, shit! Oh! 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 Ah! Oh! 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 Ah! One! Oh, shit. That was close. Damn it, why'd you make me come here, Sean? It's an adventure. That's all this is. Just a... Great time! How the hell did I end up here? You're the one who started all this. Come on, guys, we gotta keep moving. Gotta run from these snake spiders. Someone wanna tell me why we're following a chicken? He's kind of our new guide. Hey, maybe he can help us get to the surface without any more problems. Oh, you don't think I've got what it takes? No, I wasn't saying that. Don't you worry. I'll get us to the surface, no matter how long this damn journey takes. That is, if 
you're still up for it. Absolutely! Yeah, why not? We've made it this far. What's a few more stairs? Oh, um, okay, I was half hoping you'd say no. A bit more trouble on my part, but okay then, the surface it is. The sooner we get out of this hellhole, the better. How many levels of stairs do we have to climb? 20 or something? Man, my knees are hurting already. Well, I don't know. 100 levels? 200, maybe? <sighs> what the shit? Is it just me, or should there be more stairs there? Next staircase, one mile. Hey, Bunkerland residents, be sure to check out the gift shop on your long walk to the next staircase. What idiot designed this place? Okay, Dale. Mind-blowing money-making ideas. Go! Um, uh, so if someone doesn't want to buy a multi-level pass, they take the stairs, right? Right. But if we put the staircases on opposite sides of each level... Well, then they'd be forced to walk across the entire level to get to the next staircase and... And they'll have to stop at every damn gift shop and restaurant on their way. Yeah, that's what I was... Haha, <laughs> genius. How the hell do I come up with this stuff? Oh, I do feel bad for those poor saps who have to walk across every level, say, if the elevator inevitably malfunctions or breaks down in the future. Yeah, well, it could make for a great story, though. I'd watch an animated series about that. Oh, this is just great. What horrors lie beyond this door? If it's anything like what we just saw, I'd say all of them. Every one of those horrors. Man, makes me homesick for Wishlandia. Oh, we're so dead. What? This is only the beginning of our adventure. What mysteries lie ahead? What new friends and experiences? Nicely said. Hell, even if we can't reach the surface, I'm sure we'll have one hell of an adventure down in Bunkerland. Are the lights fading? Damn it! The snake spiders have control of the dimmers! Oh, oh, run! Fucking run! That's a no for me. I'm out. Those guys are royally screwed! We'll have vending machines in the bathrooms. Another. Pay to use toilets. Blast the AC. Charge extra for coats. <laughs> yes. What's something stupid that people will buy? We get Bunkerland signature bottled water. Well, you could buy it in bulk at Co Cost Half Sale Warehouse and replace the labels. Yeah, yeah what else? We get swag. We'll have hats, t shirts, some sweatshirts, water bottles, buttons, posters, magnets, you name it. Mugs. Level specific coffee mugs. The, the Bunkerland been to that level mug collection. Uh, premium air? Fresh air for those who can afford it? Oh, that's evil. And fucking genius, put it on the list. Uh, I didn't actually mean it, I mean, it's kind of diabolical. Put it on the list, Dale. Okay. Um.